In this video, let's see how to use SAP Fiori icons inside SAP Analytics Cloud. For example, if we want to change this default icons like for the date range filter, product filter and location, if we want to give a more appealing icon, then we can go to this icon explorer tool and we can search for a icon. I think this icon suits the product better. So if we want to include this icon, in our SAP Analytics Cloud, if we go ahead and if we just paste that, it wouldn't work. It will show a symbol like this because this font doesn't have that icon. So to make it work, we need to include this SAP Fury icon as a web font in our SAP Analytics Cloud. To do that, go to System, Administration and then Default Appearance. Here under Story Fonts, Click this to add a new web font and then use this URL to add SAP Fiori icons as a web font. You can find this URL in this video's description. So now the font has been added. I'll save it and refresh it. Now we can go to our story, refresh the story. Now let's edit the story. First, let's get rid of this boring icon. Now let's include the product icon. Now let's change the font to SAP Fury font. Now you can see that the icon has changed. Let's do the same with location. Let's get rid of the default icon and then let's search in the icon explorer or something relevant to location. I think this is good. Then copy it and then let's paste it in Analytics Cloud. And then let's change the font. So there we go. We have changed it and we can do the same for the date filter as well. So I think this is good or even this is better. So let's copy the icon, let's paste the icon and then let's change the font to SAP Fiery. So this is how you can use SAP Fiery icons in your SAP Analytics Cloud and make it look really stunning.